all right hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm beauty by cc if you're new here and this is my mommy hi she's here to say hi so yeah today i have this tutorial for you guys um i did this so you guys will see how i did it in the video and be sure to look at my last video it'll be right there up above your head like now oh. right here <laughs> okay <laughs> So watch my last video and yeah, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys at the end of the video. All right, so I'm gonna go in with my Jaclyn Hill palette. You already know what? And I'm gonna take these two shades, like a nude orange and an orange. <laughs> like an orange and like a taupey color, I would call it. I'm gonna take it into my transition. Make sure it's popping. Popping off. <laughs> then I'm gonna take burgundy it's very pretty and I'm gonna put that all over my lid just put it all over the whole entire lid well actually no go to the end with it the next time she'll be my friend do you want it promise that you'll never leave me lonely Alright, so I just took these two browns, this dark brown and a milk chocolate looking brown, and I'm putting them in the outer third of my eye. Pow pow. Just went back into the Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette as you guys saw. And yeah, blend it out. Blend it, blend it into that burgundy. Next, I'm going to take this taupe color. And I'm going to blend the burgundy into the orange with that kind of ish. Then I'm going to use this dark green color. Deep, deep, like forest green. I'd call it like forest green. And I'm going to put it on my waterline underneath, underneath my eye. I said underneath. Underneath my eye. Yeah, just blend it. I don't go all the way in because my eye waters easily. So just go like to the outer two thirds. And then I'm gonna take the sparkly green color and put it in my inner corner, my tear ducts, basically. Then I'm gonna take the NK Makeup Art Liner and I'm going to wing out my liner. I'm gonna create a perfect wing. Looks really, really good. Now that I look, like watch it back, it looks really, really, really good. <laughs> Now I'm gonna zoom y'all in. Come closer. <laughs> I'm using. All right, I'm gonna use the same exact liner, and I'm gonna use that to draw the string for my Christmas lights. I'm sorry I was out of frame, but yeah, you guys kind of get the gist when you watch it. You'll see me more out of frame, and I'm sorry. So I mixed some colors from the Morphe 35B palette, and I mixed them and onto this little palette that I just showed you guys. 
So first I'm taking this dark yellow color and I'm going to mix it with a little bit of white. And I mix them with castor oil, but you can mix them with cake solvent. I'll link them down below. Like I'll link both castor oil and cake solvent down below. But yeah, next I'm going to take this blue color and some castor oil. But yeah, I'm just drawing these little tiny bulbs on my string to make it look like Christmas lights. Next is this orangey red. I don't have a red red eyeshadow, like a real bright red, but I use this orangey red. And these are all in the Morphe 35B palette again, just in case you missed it the first time I said it. <laughs> but then I'm going to take the orange color and mix it with some white because it was a little too deep when I first mixed it. So yeah. So I put yellow, then blue, then red, then orange, then I'll put yellow again, and then blue again. So yeah. I was asking my mom if it looked good. <laughs> then on my palette, I used the Aiko London eyeliner, and I like dabbed it on my palette, and then used the same brush that I was using to make my bulbs, and I used that to outline my bulbs make them look more popping it turned out really well <laughs> so I'm gonna zoom y'all out again So I'm going to take the NYX Crystal Liner and Crystal Hip and I'm going to trace that black string, just make it pop in. It looks really, really cute with all this glitter on it. It looks super cute. So I'm going to take the Rocket Mascara by Maybelline and I'm going to put mascara on. Then I'm going to take the AOA Studio False Lashes in L. I did them after I finished my whole face. That's why I have like lipstick and highlight on already. But that's usually when I put um, the lash glue on my lashes and then I let them sit to the side and then put them on at the end. So yeah. She don't let me cause I'm dangerous. That boom boom some like angel dust. Girl, let me hold ya. Put me ting all around ya. Make me feel like a whore ya. Give me that boom like a warrior. Hit that boom like. Can I have a question for ya? Can I give you an answer? Yeah, yeah. So then I'm going to spray my face with MAC Fix Plus Spray and then I'm going to highlight like usual with my MAC Soft and Gentle and then I'm going to brow highlight with the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder and Precious Petals. Now I'm going to take my Kylie Cosmetics lip pencil in Dolce K and I'm going to take this other lip pencil in Mousse. I don't know who, what the brand is. Um, I got it a long time ago. so But it's a really good nude color. And I just mix them together and line my lips. Then I'm going to take the Sephora Collection lip stain in Chai Latte and put that all over my lips. And voila, there's the lips. They look perfect. Then I'm going to set my face with the Makeup Revolution setting spray and I'm done. I forgot to do a slow mo, so here's a beautiful picture. You're welcome. <laughs> Bye. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you guys for 
thank you <laughs> thank you guys for being here for supporting me don't forget to like the video also don't forget to check out my last video the link is in the description follow me what <laughs> follow me on all my social medias they're in the description below and i'll see you guys in my next video never forget to stay positive stay blessed and always remember to love yourself i love you cc fam Thinking about you, yeah. Thinking about.